Hey guys, it's Daryl's Probs here, and this is episode 5 of the MCC Tool Chest Guide. Today we're doing custom fireworks. Now in here I've got 5 fireworks, you know the ones from the creative inventory. And we're just going to customise them. Now what do I mean by customising them? Custom colours, that's what I mean. So I'm talking like neon green, neon blue, you know, things like that. And I'll show you a firework that you can add loads of colours to basically. So I'll try and make like a rainbow, but I'll just put it in tonight just to show you what these are. They're just the bog standard ones, you know, that are on the creative menu. So we're going to edit these, okay? Apart from that last one, I custom made that one. It's the only one that's a large ball. You see, I've got each type then. So large ball is obviously the bigger bang. And that's small ball, I think. Yeah. And that's obviously got a twinkle effect, that's what it is. So we're going to hop onto the PC now. We've got these in our hand, okay? So then we're going to go on the play inventory. So I'll catch you on the PC. So on a PC, we're going to extract the save onto the desktop, like we always do. Obviously, we saved our file on the USB stick. So, minimize this one, if I can. Nope, I've made that bigger somehow. Uh, MCC tool chest, that's what we want. So, you make this one big, and then go on desktop, find our save game, find our player, which is here. Go to me, obviously. And then we got these five fireworks in our inventory. Look. So we, that's each one of those fireworks. So, uh, i trying to remember which order it was. I think this one here is that pinky one with a big burst. Yeah. So with a firework, you get a tag and it says fireworks. And then you get explosions and you get flight. Now flight is obviously how long it lasts for before it explodes. So you can actually put that either 1 or to 99. That's the maximum you can do. You can't go any higher than that. But 99 is a long time. So I don't know if you can actually do 0. Uh, it might be possible actually. I think it is actually. As soon as you let it off it doesn't blow up straight away. It's about... I don't know, half a second or something. It is possible. I've tried it actually. So I'll leave this one on half a second. I'm just going to show you this one and the others I'll speed up and go for it. So this one, he's got two things. Okay, so we got flicker. And if you want that on or off, you press, you click on it and you press zero is like it's off and one is like it's on. And then type, okay. Now I'm going to uh, put a little link in the description for this website. So this is Minecraft updates slash fireworks. Now this is where what I found how to do these custom fireworks. So it says explosion type here, look. So this is if you want, I don't know, loads of fireworks at once. So I was just doing one. So we'll go for a large ball and we choose colours. I don't know, we can just choose three for now. Uh, we'll make him green, like... A crazy green and then a really really light there we go bright blue and let's just make it a bit more of a weird limey green like that and then we'll just fade it into black okay so we'll put flicker on for this one and trail as well just so you can see and then you hit this orange button here generate and it comes up here. Now this is actually for PC, so that's like for a command block. So if you are on PC, I don't know why you'd be watching this, but if you are, that's how you do that for command blocks. But sadly for us on console, we don't have command blocks yet. So you got to go through this. Let's. It says type here one. So large ball must be number one then. So we go here, type one. Okay, pretty straightforward. Flicker if you want that, type 1, we got that. Trail, now we need to retype this, so if we copy that, control C, and then open up this and add a byte tag, and then put that in, trail, and we'll have 1. Easier. Next, colours. 
Now it says colors here. Now that is this one, okay? And it's if you double click on that, you get this come up, okay? Now that is the color code for that. So this 65314 is this green here, yeah? But in code format. So we'll copy that. Get rid of that rubbish. And then paste that. Now you need to this is important, you need to press space twice, okay? If you're adding more colours. Then we copy that. And you guessed it. Paste. Space twice. Whoops. Trying to go quick because it's boring, isn't it? Copy that. And paste that. Easy. Hit OK when you're done. Now, I haven't tried a, a maximum. I don't know what the maximum is, but I had 10 on one rocket. So that worked fine as well. So that's that. And now if we want to add a fade color, we just, again, copy that. And then get one of these up, okay? Which I think is an array tag, is it? Yep. So you click that. And just press that like that. Oh, so we've got one in there, okay? But ignore everything that says, because that that color there, zero, is actually the one we need, which is quite funny. So zero is black, as you can see. I know that from playing around with colors before. So that's quite funny. So we've already got a fade color, black, and that's it, guys. That's as easy as that, really. I mean. Thanks to this website, whoever created it, underneath this website here. It's just made our lives easier for this, but... Anyway, I'll speed up the video now, and finish off the others, and we'll do some wacky ones, maybe, shall we? wanted to mention as well when it comes to when you've done the fourth color you need to press enter okay or else it will not work as well just thought I'd let you know <laughs> And there we go guys so it's quite long-winded that you have to copy and paste but once it's all done you know it's not too bad but anyway let's get on the Xbox and see what happens <laughs> okay let's try these out then shall we right it's already in night time I think in it yep cool so as you can see it says now look Large ball, custom, 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 fade to custom. That's because we've modified it. Flight duration zero. So here we go. Alright. That's the one we did together, you remember? See, it's not quite just zero. It's like half a second. It's really bright green, yeah? So next is a creeper head. With loads of rainbow colours. See? Oh, I like that. That's really cool. Oh, it didn't flip around the right way. Anyway, you get the idea. Uh, next was just to show you you can make it go on forever. Look. 99. <laughs> I mean, I've seen you've seen that in videos. If you watch me a lot, you've probably seen that already. Four in one of my maps or something. And this one, I've made this without an explosion, okay? Now you're thinking, what the hell's that for? Ah, well, tu 53s around the corner, isn't it? So this would be perfect for the Elytra. Because, you know, if you equip your wings on the new update, you can fly with a rocket. You get an extra boost. Do you know what I mean? It's on the PC, but they're bringing it. But... If you have a an explosion from it, it damages you. So this is perfect for that. 
And then lastly, we just got another random one. That, do you remember, did you see me edit in that one? You did, didn't you? So that was yellow, and then it's fade into like a purple. See? Easy. But that's it, guys. I mean, to be honest, it's fairly straightforward. I think the best one has got to be the creeper one I've done. But, ah, oh, that looks awesome. I like that. <laughs> but that's custom fireworks. Really easy. Um, yeah. Thanks very much for watching. I'm Darren Probs. Catch you in the next one.